Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today we're going to continue our HTML5 series by talking about figure and fig caption. Now, figure is an element for content that's essential to the understanding of the content, the main content on the page, but might not be in the necessary flow of the document. So, uh, you know, figure could be used a lot for an image with a caption or maybe a table with a caption or something. Uh, you could even use it for code examples, things like that. So in this article, we're going to add an image that has a caption underneath it. So let's actually put this uh, just underneath our header before a paragraph. And this is going to just be figure. And, and now inside of our figure, we can have an image and I'm actually just grabbing a placeholder image. And we're also going to have a caption for this. So right underneath the image itself, within the figure tag, we're going to write fig caption. And this figure caption, you can just put text in here, a nice animal picture. And maybe this is uh, information about who took the photo with a link to their portfolio or something. Uh, this is right now is just describing the picture. Now let's go to our page and refresh. You notice here's our animal uh, picture and here's our heading, a nice animal picture. We can look in our code here. We have our figure, fig caption. So what this is really doing is telling the browser and telling search engines, uh, anything that's understanding your site really, that this image and this caption, they're related. And more importantly, that they're related to the content within this article. And they might not necessarily be in the flow of this article, maybe on a normal page, this content is in the sidebar. But it is saying that it is a part of the main content, regardless of it's in the flow of the document or not. So let's add uh, another example. And let's show you how you can actually use fig caption to describe a few images within a figure tag. And now I'm actually going to modify the size of these images and then go ahead and change this one to two so that they show up as different animals here. I'm going to refresh. We now have these three pictures and this caption is going to be relating all of these images. So you can certainly nest more images than one within a figure tag. It just means that the figure caption has to do with all of the images itself. Now, like I said, you can use figure to wrap, uh, you know, uh, lines of code and then have a caption describing that code, maybe the licensing. You can use uh, figure to wrap a canvas, maybe SVG something. Uh, so you can use figure for lots of things. It really is just saying that the content is essential uh, to the document, uh, to the understanding of the document. Whereas with something like a side, the aside content is not really essential to the document itself. Great. Well, let me know if you have any questions. Leave a comment in the video. Or hit us up at Twitter, Level Up Tuts. Let us know what you're thinking. We'd love to hear from you. As always, this is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and thanks for watching.